Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and my new filming room. I'm hoping everything is working. I only moved last week. Everything is still like, but guys are sh everywhere. In today's video, we are talking about fat face or more specifically, face fat. <laughs> and for some reason, having a fat face or having face fat is seen as like an insult. Another day, another floor, another cosmetic surgery. These beauty standards are never ending. There's always something wrong with us, always something else we have to fix. And now having a fat face or a round face or full cheeks is just another floor to add to that list. Hence why you guys have probably seen this new trend called buckle fat removal surgery. It is rapidly gaining popularity, which is kind of concerning in itself. It is where people will pay a plastic surgeon to cut open their cheeks and remove the buckle fat from underneath their cheekbones. Think Bella Hadid, Leah Michelle, Emily Ratajkowski, Chrissy Teigen, Miley Cyrus. These are all celebrity women who are rumored to have undergone buckle fat removal surgery. And you guys, I'm not going to lie. I know I'm not meant to say it, but we're honest on this channel, right? It kind of disgusts me. Buckle fat removal promises to give the look of hollowed out cheekbones, a sculpted face, supermodel cheekbones, no contour needed. Now the pros to buckle fat removal is that it's a day job. Apparently it only takes 20 minutes to do. These surgical incisions are made inside your cheeks. And so if you are like many of the celebrities and influencers out there who like to deny, deny, deny that they've had any cosmetic surgery done, there will be no visible scars. So you can deny this if you want to. Another pro, if you consider this to be a pro is that the results are permanent. So even if you end up gaining weight in the future, you will never ever again have this fat here. When it's gone, it's gone. And you know what guys, if you like that look and it's something you feel strongly about and you think having buckle fat removal is going to make you happier in the long run, then all power to you. If however, you don't have the money to pay a plastic surgeon to remove your buckle fat and you are the owner of a round or fat face and this new flaw that's been discovered has left you feeling pretty damn insecure about this round face, then my friends, this video is for you. Before we get into the video, I want to say a massive thank you to Toon Blast for working with me and sponsoring this video. This video almost didn't happen because I was too busy playing Toon Blast. <laughs> Toon Blast is a free to play mobile game available on all devices. Toon Blast is a mobile game that encompasses everything good in the world of mobile games. It's got cute characters, fun colors, 7,000 levels. And if you don't feel like playing alone and you're more of a people person, you can actually join other Toon Blast players to create teams to unlock more rewards, which is fun. One thing I really love about Toon Blast in particular is that you don't actually need a Wi-Fi or internet connection to play. I am renowned for always having my phone on airplane. No one can ever get through to me, but I can still play Toon Blast, which I love. Ever since downloading Toon Blast, one of my favorite things to do in the evening is chill out, pour myself a cup of tea, sit on the lounge, put my phone on airplane, and just zone out playing Toon Blast. I love that there are no ads disrupting my play because that is so annoying. There's also lots of fun and challenging mini games you can play to win rewards, so much so that Toon Blast has millions of reviews and high ratings on the Apple Store and Google Play. So if any of you guys are kind of sick of mindless scrolling social media and you want a new mobile game to play, I will put the link to download it in the description box down below. Use the link in the description box down below to get three hours unlimited lives and a hundred coins. And we can have a little challenge to see who gets to the highest level. Sure, having the chiseled, razor sharp cheekbones from the 90s supermodels would be cool. It gives you an edgy look. It's very fashion. I get it. It looks chic. I can see the appeal. Somewhere along the line, we have decided that those with round faces or full cheeks are ugly. That this is a flaw that needs to be fixed and can be corrected with surgery. And I want this video to be your gentle reminder that if you are the owner of a fat face, that there is absolutely nothing wrong with you. You don't need to put your face on a diet. You don't need to have razor sharp bone structure to be beautiful. Your face may not be on trend right now, but I believe your face will become a trend. Your time will come. Hold on to that buckle fat. Let's take a look at some of the world's most beautiful women with round faces, with face fat, who have actually refused to undergo buckle fat removal surgery to keep up with this trend. But Gigi Hadid. Gigi has actually come out and said in the past that she thinks women are too quick to make permanent changes to their face. Maybe she's thinking about her sister Bella who had a nose job at the age of 14 and now regrets it. Potentially Gigi learned her lesson via Bella and now refuses to make any changes to her face, Gigi is blessed with a beautiful, round, full-cheeked, angelic face and bone structure and I so hope that Gigi doesn't feel the pressure being in the modeling industry to make any changes to that gorgeous face shape. Like for example, it looks like here they've contoured her to oblivion to try and give her those sharp cheekbones. I think it just looks kind of peculiar, like she still looks beautiful, I know, but it just looks kind of weird compared to her normal face, like we're not all meant to have razor sharp cheekbones like this. Selena Gomez, another absolute beauty of our time with her Mexican and 
and Italian heritage, she is too the proud owner of a round face. She has face fat. It's normal. She's beautiful. Imagine Selena with buckle fat removal surgery. Like it just doesn't work. With Selena's bone structure and her facial fat stores, she's 31 now, but she could easily pass as someone 10 years younger. Then we have Jennifer Lawrence, who is generally regarded as one of the most beautiful actresses to have ever existed. And she has a round face. And as you can see, it doesn't detract from her beauty. Buckle fat removal would not make her hotter. It wouldn't make her more attractive. She's absolutely perfect as she is. I'm looking down because I'm looking at her picture right now on my laptop. Her face is glowing. It's round. It's youthful. She looks vital. She looks healthy. She looks well fed. These are all goals. These unrealistic beauty standards that are being placed on me and you and Jennifer Lawrence and every other woman that lives right now. It's trying to make us all fit into one mold, fit into one box. And it's like, if you don't fit into this box, not only are you ugly, you need to spend your money getting this corrected via cosmetic procedures. And if you look like this instead of this, you're not attractive. You're not beautiful. You don't fit these beauty standards. But it's like, no, because actually some of the world's most beautiful women have this face shape that is currently not considered beautiful. And it's like, are you telling me that these women aren't beautiful? Because to me, they're pretty bloody beautiful. Look at Chrissy Teigen, for example. She was also the owner of a round face. She had some beautiful fat stores in her face and she actually did undergo buckle fat removal surgery. Now, I don't know if she was happy with the results or not, but for me, when I look at her, I'm like, why would you change that beautiful face? People literally pay good money to cosmetic injectors to get this kind of face. And here is Chrissy paying a cosmetic surgeon to remove the fat from her face. And it's like, loco, we're going crazy. I personally think that these women that are rumored to have undergone buckle fat removal surgery, I think they looked better before. I think they looked beautiful with their buckle fat. And I know that it's frowned upon to say that someone that's had cosmetic procedures done looked better before. And I get it, I do. But on the other hand, I'm like, it's okay to compliment someone on their original looks. And I think buckle fat looks better in the face than out. Now, if any of you guys watching have a round face or a fat face and you currently feel insecure about it, and I know there's a lot of you out there that do feel insecure about having a fat face because I went onto Google and I typed in how to get rid of fat. And like the fifth thing that came up was how to get rid of fat face, how to get rid of a double chin. And it's like, why would you want to get rid of that? It's so beautiful. And I want this video to be proof to you that a fat face is a beautiful face. Caveat, that does not mean that a bony face is not a beautiful face. There are so many ways to be beautiful. Interesting to note if you are feeling insecure about your round face is that throughout history, both ancient and recent history, round faces have been the epitome of beauty. They have been a symbol of health, wealth and youth. In ancient China, for example, round faces were symbolic with the feminine ideal. Ancient Japan, same thing. Round and rosy cheeks were the epitome of beauty. The 1950s, for example, which wasn't even that long ago in the grand scheme of things, was all about looking well-fed, looking healthy, looking like Marilyn Monroe, who had very full cheeks and a full body. Heck, even angels have been depicted as having round faces. Why? Because round faces are cherubic. They are youthful. They are gorgeous. Now, if you have a round face and you have been considering getting buckle fat removal surgery or if you can't afford to get buckle fat removal surgery so instead you're just left feeling insecure about your round face let me tell you this as we age we naturally lose our buckle fat stores as you get older your facial fat naturally breaks down and that includes your buckle fat and this is why a lot of old women will end up with a kind of gaunt hollowed out look naturally and I'm not saying that's a bad thing at all I don't play into ageism however it is a fact of life and it is something to embrace but it just makes you realize that running out to a cosmetic surgeon to remove your buckle fat prematurely is a bit daft. So hold tight, my beautiful round faced friends, your time will come, your face will be on trend. And then those people that have had their buckle fat removed will be like, well, feck, how do I get my buckle fat back? And no doubt then there'll be some cosmetic procedure where you can have like fat injected under your cheekbones to get a full faced look. It's like, this is what happens with beauty standards. They come and they go. One minute you're trending and then the next you're not. And this is why I don't advocate for permanent plastic surgery, okay, fillers, Botox, they're temporary for the most part. Permanently changing your looks based on the current beauty standard is not a good idea, in my personal opinion. I know a lot of you guys are gonna disagree with me. There's a lot of people on YouTube that'll disagree with me. That's okay, that's just my personal opinion. But if you have a fat face, if you have a round face, if you have full cheeks, you are beautiful and you don't need to change. I hope you now feel good about yourself because you are beautiful, you're amazing, and you deserve to feel good. Don't forget to download Toon Blast. I will have the link in the description box down below. Use the link in the description box down below to get three hours unlimited lives and 100 coins. 
I know what I'm going to be doing tonight when I put my boys to bed. I'm going to sit in the lounge. I'm going to play Toon Blast with a cup of tea and chill out. Love your guts and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.